hurts. Uh, but, you know, we're trying to just try to move on. You know, we're in a tough spot right now. Just going to try to, you know, get a win. And, and that's all we can do, just try to get another win. How can you kind of explain kind of what's gone different these last four games? We're not doing the little things. Uh, we kind of got away with it for a while. But, you know, we're not rebounding the ball. We, Getting teams, they sh we're not paying attention to tendencies and just giving people, letting people do what they want to do instead of dictating. So it's just some things we gotta, some things we gotta fix. It's different than the other three, though. I mean, it's like you struggled on the offensive end, not setting it in this one, which it hadn't been the case. Yeah, we didn't shoot it well at all. Uh, coach was saying, you know, we started off with a couple tough shots, and it's tough to get going after that. So we got to work on, you know, penetrating, kicking. We only had six assists tonight, so we weren't making plays for each other. So yeah, offense, we we didn't play very well. You know, period, we didn't play very well at all. You worry about the confidence of your guys? Uh, nah, you know, we got a bunch of fighters in there. We're going to bounce back. You know, we're going to take it to the practice floor and just, you know, try to work it out. We're just going to keep going. We're going to keep fighting. You guys said that you guys are going to make some changes on defensive back in this game. Do you at least see some of that in this game today? Uh, we made a couple, but then, you know, there we go. We had our lapses again, you know. Uh, we still play defense in spurts. We don't play full 40 minutes yet. We don't play hard the whole time, so. That's just some of the stuff we got to, you know, get by. How much does the desperation factor grow with each loss, and how do you combat that? Uh, each loss, it gets tougher and tougher to get out this uh, hole we're digging. Uh, you know, this is four in a row, so, you know, we're just going to try to, you know, we're just trying to put it behind us and just try to keep moving forward. All we can do is just, we're not going to waste any energy on what has happened. We're just going to keep putting all our energy and going forward and just trying to get this win so we can get out of this hole. You talked about lapses. What was the most damaging uh, defensively, uh, we said we weren't going to give them any uh, back doors. We weren't going to, you know, get up and deny. We're just going to sit back and let them run their Princeton, and we didn't do that. You know, they got a couple layups off that, and that really energized them. Uh, so that's that's one thing we didn't, you know, we didn't pay attention to detail on that. Do you see a performance like this happening after the week of practice? It sounded like you guys were very confident. No, I, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't expecting it at all. But you know, hats off to them. They played they played well today. They really hit the boards, and, and they did what they had to do. You guys made a couple runs at him in that second half, got to within six or seven a few times, but couldn't get any closer. Was that a matter of just too big of a hole right out of the gate or what? Uh, nah, uh, putbacks. You know, we weren't, they were hitting offensive glass and we weren't boxing out, and that'll be a dagger right there. You know, we get down six and then boom, offensive rebound, layup. That's eight. You know, it just took kind of energy out of us. So, got to get back to those boards and do the little things. What's it like to lose here? You guys haven't had that experience. For you. Yeah, I've, I've never had the experience. So, you know, it, it, that's why I'm saying it hurts, you know. But I'm going to try not to dwell on it, just try to move forward, you know. We get another shot at him in our play, so it's all good. We're just going to have to, you know, get him there. With so many new transfers, has it been a little bit harder? Has there any sense that it's been hard to come together as a team in these, in these last four games as a unit? <sighs> no, you know, things just aren't going our way right now. You know, every team hits adversity. There's many teams across the country losing three, four games in a row. Uh, it happens. You know, they don't they don't all have transfers, so you know it happens. We just we're trying to combat everything and just keep keep going hard. That's all we can do. You only had one field goal attempt tonight. You've been so, you know, good about getting your own shot this year. Was that, was that the game plan you're trying to facilitate? Uh, that that's just what happened. Uh, that's just what happened during the game. Uh, but that's we didn't have a lot of ball movement. It kind of stuck to one guy, and then somebody will go. We weren't making plays for each other, so you know all that. All that was you know something that uh, uh, was a, was a plus to that. You seem to still be trying to keep a positive attitude here. What are the, what's the mood of the other guys? Uh, you know, coach got, just got done talking to us, so you know it comes from him. You know, he just he tried to tell us to stay positive. You know, don't worry about it. We're just gonna keep moving forward. We're not gonna watch film on this game because we're not gonna dwell on it. We're just gonna keep moving forward. Worry about the next ones, so we don't waste any energy on it. Is this one of those games where you know the mistakes you made without having to watch the film? Yeah, you know, we pretty much know. Uh, we know we got backdoored at crucial times. We weren't going to let that happen. Uh, we know we know that we didn't uh, offensive rebound. Well, I mean, we know we didn't hit the defensive rebounds, and uh, they, they got too many offensive rebounds at crucial times, too. So, you know, you can pretty pretty much get a sense of what, what happened without even looking at the film. Are those lapses more of a miscommunication at this point, or is it just, is it just uh, lack of focus? I, uh, I think it's both. Uh, our, our talk was better today, but that's one thing we're trying to focus on to get better at, too, is communicating with each other. But yeah, uh, lack, of, lack of communication and, and a lack of focus. You know, people will fall asleep. You know, have, I'm guilty of it, too. You know, first, first three cook hit, you know, I fell asleep, relaxed for a second, and then he popped to the corner, and boom, you know. So you know, I, that could have got him started. I don't know, but, you know, it just it, it hurts for that to happen like that. So why does it keep continuing to happen? You guys don't know that? 
I don't really have an answer. Uh, I guess we don't have that sense of urgency yet, but you know, I don't understand why, but we just don't as a team have that sense of urgency to understand that we got to play D and we got to play hard for 40 minutes. You know, coach keeps harping on it, but for some reason it's not it's not happening. So it's something we're going to have to just try to, you know, keep keep talking to each other, keep preaching around the locker room, on the practice floor, and then, you know, when it clicks, it clicks, you know. I'm just waiting on that day. Say as coaches keep saying something, is, is there somebody on the team that needs to say something that's not saying something yet? Uh, in terms of it's take, taking the leadership role and being vocal on the court and directing traffic or whatever, I mean, taking uh, he just he wants somebody to you know just start to talk, just somebody if somebody is constantly doing it, you know, it's kind of contagious. But you know, uh, we just haven't had that one guy to just talk constantly and the whole time 40 minutes. So we're still trying to work on that, and you know, hopefully we'll, we'll iron it out.